what is going on everybody we have a music visualizer to check out not a music video so don't get confused what mv stands for bm is here with strangers gonna um enjoy what this has to bring for us um if this is not the entire song then we'll end up checking out the entire song afterwards along with the b-side that is with this digital single um so yeah before we hop into it though do you need to tell you briefly about the patreon there i do dance practice reactions performance reactions cover reactions all on a daily basis if that kind of stuff interests you well then i guess you should be clicking that link in the description box join those people who have scrolled on the screen and i'd greatly appreciate it but yeah let us get into strangers so when will we meet my friends so y'all know that stranger song do you you don't know nothing about no wolf's rain. Do we have? I don't think we have subtitles, so let's get it. Hey. Okay. Okay. Kind of went from trap to a more upbeat dance pop tune. Inside of this little area, <laughs> creating this lovely BM statue. Oh, a different place for the Mustang to drive. Like that little added harmony they put in there. Oh. track not necessarily in love with it lyrically but as a vibe it's cool you know well let's check out the b-side track along with this all right y'all so we got bad intentions here to check out so let's go ahead and get right into it the pulse now got a little flanger on the voice Party track. You got bad intentions. She throw it back and she drop low. Make it hard to resist like. Uh. Okay. Cool little drop. She got bad intentions. 
Bad bitty on the line, said pull up at nine, said emojis to imply, she gon' bust it for me, why? Love it when your hips whine, better bag it, work your thighs, with them bees through the night. Ah, ah, what you need, I'm providing it. Mess around and break a spine with it. I could be a little rougher, I could be polite with it. Hey, your toes curl up when I slide in it. Oh. Go submarine in the ocean. Okay. Get on top and ride it like it's stolen. Throw it back like shots during spring break. And you know that we gon' wait it till the springs break. Bad bitty on the line, said pull up at nine. She got bad intentions. Uh huh. And I'm vamp lady and I'm broke. Got the 1942 with me feeling like. So, overall, like the beat more on this one bad intentions but yeah man with bm like you you truly kind of get <laughs> the weird combination of the two worlds he's like kind of been in i feel like you get some of the the k-popness in the production um even though this definitely still is kind of like a little bit more it's like it's like k K hip pop, <laughs> um, you know that weird, weird blurred line that that K pop was to play when it's doing more of their rap focused songs, but yet it still has like a dance kind of beat, but it's still clearly meant for like a rap mentality. And then not only are you getting the rap mentality like in like the production you have more of an american rap mentality when it comes to the lyrics so then it's kind of more like popular hip-hop here in the states over kind of like that k hip-hop slash hip pop kind of sound which is an interesting clash of things so it's just like you can get like that American sounding lyrics with a little bit more explicit stuff and and just like yeah I'm dope I take your chick even though it's not necessarily I'll take your chick but I'll do things to this chick she gonna like it because I'm that one with the chick <laughs> um, you know that that kind of mentality that this that's you know very prevalent in in uh, you know mainstream hip hop over here um, and I know there's like some of that stuff in Korea too but to hear it in English over this kind of production is such an interesting blend to my brain that makes me say interesting <laughs> um, and so therefore I have to say um, I would probably would listen to Bad Intentions more than Strangers just because I like the beat a bit more and um, but both of them are okay they're okay songs to me um, uh, like you know I always end up saying like with K-Hip-Hop like the biggest hurdle for me is is not being able to understand the lyrics so here bm being a, a fluent english speaker uh you know native to the language he's fluent <laughs> in english so these are his english songs but me understanding his lyrics and me just being kind of like mm, kind of generic lyrics <laughs> makes me say even more so eh, they're all right the beats are cool the way he kind of sing songy ways his way through some of it is nice and yeah it just le it leaves me in an it leaves me in an awkward place where it's just like mm, everything about it is okay beats make it a bit more bearable to listen to these kind of lyrics you know, being that I can actually understand that it's lyrics about these kind of topics, but 
maybe I'm getting maybe I'm getting too deep into this, especially since now um, I've probably been talking longer than the actual music has been. Um, but tell me what you guys think. Um, <laughs> uh, it's just yeah, I'm I'm particular about my I'm particular about my raps, bro. I'm particular about <laughs> I'm particular about it because it's something that I do and that I've lived in and been around for so long. That's why I'm just like, I'm so particular about my taste here. Um, but anyway, tell me what you guys think. If you enjoyed hearing my thoughts, because it's mainly what you ended up hearing in this video if you watched it all the way through, tell me what you think down below. Uh, like the button, subscribe for more reactions and reviews, um, and uh, Patreon link if you'd like to support further. Until next time, y'all, much love, peace. Peace.